Um, this is a player who genuinely believes he's still the best player in the world. Do you know how delusional that is? Do you know how narcissistic you have to be to still think you're the best player in the world at 37 years of age? But let's go back. Let's go back. Let's go back. So Manchester City, uh, United are getting uh, smoked. Uh, Ten Hag looks at the bench. He's like, out of respect, out of respect to you, I'm not going to bring you on. Right? That's his decision to be respectful. Ronaldo didn't deny that. Ten Hag is like, okay, fine. Next game's against Spurs. Maybe came a bit after that. United are playing the best match of the season, the best performance of the season against Spurs. When a team is playing that good. Why in the hell would you bring on a finito player, especially when your team is winning, right? But three minutes to go, let's waste some time. That's what you are now. We're wasting time. But since you did want to come on, we'll bring you on. We'll bring you on. On you come. And now you don't want to come. Which one is it? Which one is it? You don't want to come on the pitch? You want to come on the pitch? Which one is it? Which one is it? <laughs> I thought that was the worst bit, right? I thought that was the worst bit. No. <laughs> no. no. Here's the worst bit. This guy. <laughs> this guy thinks that the fact that he got suspended for, for three days, that this was some sort of like unjustly never should have happened. It's something that is like the end of the world. And Cristiano Jr., by the way, that Cristiano Jr. story, that should be on the did not happen uh, yearly awards on Twitter because I can rest assured that conversation did not happen. But anyways, um, this guy thinks that even after coming off the, off the um, away, going to, to the freaking off the stadium, he thinks that that's fine, right? Like there should be no repercussions. What kind of delusional mentality is that? I am so confused. And then this freaking dick rider, Mr. Morgan, good Lord Almighty, acting like he knows what's happening. Unless Ronaldo has literally given him all the information and even made the questions himself. Because that's what we're probably seeing here. Ronaldo made the questions himself in Portuguese. They got translated, Pierce is just translating them in English and back and forth. Now, here comes the famous Glazers one, right? Which, you know, so many Manchester United fans, of course, are on, are on Ronaldo's side. So, let me get this right. The owners, the same owners who have brought in uh, Sancho, who have brought in uh, Vawan, bear in mind Sancho, right? You know, 90, 100 million uh, on, on, on Jadon Sancho. Look at him now. Uh, on himself, right? When they really never should have. They brought the best defensive midfielder in the world to play Thursday night. Are we deep in that? Thursday night? They got him to play Thursday night, bro. If you had your time again,